Hey y'all, I'm Anna the Archer. I wanted to pass along some information that I recently learned about left versus right helical fletching. Like, which way do I fletch my arrow? So there is a way to determine that if you'd like to know it. So you're gonna shoot your arrow's bare shaft. And what you're gonna need, you're gonna need a silver Sharpie and you're gonna make a mark along your arrow. And the natural spin of the arrow is gonna determine which way you fletch your, your arrows. So you're gonna get really close to the target. You only wanna be like five to six feet away. And I said feet, not yards. So you wanna be really close because you don't want your arrow to make a full rotation because you wanna see which way the line is going. And that will determine whether you fletch with a left or right helical. All right, y'all, so we're about five, six feet away from the target. And you wanna make sure that line is facing up when you knock that arrow so you know which way it's gonna turn. You wanna make sure that the arrow doesn't make a full rotation so then you can figure out which way that arrow is going to turn for you. All right, now as you can see, the line has rotated to the left for me. And so that means that I would fletch this with a left helical. So now that I've shown y'all that process, you might have a question for me. You might be like, Anna, do I really have to do this to fletch my arrows? And the answer is no. This is all personal preference. Some people swear by this technique, some don't. This is a new technique that I learned recently and you know, it's the natural spin of your arrow. Why fight the natural spin? So we'll give it a shot, see if it works. And if it doesn't, hey, you tried it. So uh, let me know how it goes for y'all and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.